Money issues are keeping people from doing a lot of things these days, and adoption is not an exception. The costs associated with adoption are keeping some potential parents from making the commitment to extend their families. SNN Local News 6 reporter Jessica Jordan has more on why adoption agencies are in search for qualified parents now more than ever. Adopting a child is a big decision for many families. Four months after we, um, we signed up, we were notified that we'd been selected and um, we were going to be uh, parents. But adoption agencies are seeing less families who are motivated to take on the added expense of a child. They say these days, especially, many potential parents have to make a decision based on their bank account. It's, it's a sad situation, but it is our reality. And some of these folks that are having their third and fourth child, they just can't afford to have that child. The Department of Children and Families says about 2,000 children are available for adoption and are actively seeking permanent families. That's part of the reason Michael Miner and his wife decided to adopt. There's no more joy than you know being a parent, and I would be frightened off about anything. I would uh, encourage people to sit down, talk to qualified people in the adoption business. Miner worked with Family Creations, a local adoption agency that matched he and his wife with a birth family. The agency is working to place children from seven domestic birth families and hundreds of international families, but there aren't enough potential parents to give all these kids a home. We have children that are in the foster care system, and then we have children that are private adoptions through families that just feel at this point they're not prepared to be parents. DCF says the costs associated with adoption include court costs and attorney fees, which can total less than $500. There's no greater joy and we wouldn't have traded uh, what we've been through for, for anything. Jessica Jordan for SNN Local News 6.